Hello and welcome back to Farming Simulator 19. You're watching JCTV playing on the Xbox One console. This is Stranded in Oakfield, episode number 18. 1 8. Episode number 18 here on JCTV. Thanks for tuning in, folks. Before we get started today, why don't you click that notification button for me and make sure that the notifications are turned on and also click that subscribe button in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. You guys don't want to miss anything that is coming up. Also, if you can, like and share this video as well. That would be greatly appreciated. So what we're going to be doing today on Oakfield Farms is we've made an executive decision. We sold some land. We sold field number one. Just got rid of it. We're going to be selling field number two as well. We don't need it. It is not essential to the operation, and we're also going to purchase field number six in our bid to clean the front three fields, five, six, and seven. Uh, maybe we'll purchase five next episode. Uh, there is some landscaping that needs to be done. We need to remove some trees um, in and around the farm. Um, there is a big tree in the middle of field six and field five. Um, we'll do six first. Uh, the tree in field six needs to be removed. So why don't we go down to field six, the field that we just purchased now, and we'll have a look around. Uh, currently, it is 100% grass. Um, we just did a, a lot of silage, and I don't really want to do any more. So, um, yeah, we're going to check on this first before we go down to the field. This is our wool stock. You can see here that we've got uh, several pellets of wool we are currently stocking. We don't even have a trailer to put it on um, as of yet. So there's, what, four, five, six, seven pellets of wool. I think we're just going to fill up this little warehouse thing. Maybe we'll move that cultivator out of the way at some point and we'll just stockpile the wool hopefully by the time the shed is full of wool someone would have modded a auto loading pallet trailer hint hint someone would have modded an auto loading pallet trailer for consoles i don't know if that uh, subtle hint could get any clearer um, i am looking for an auto loading pallet trailer for consoles all right let's open up the gate to field number six this is a pretty huge field um we're not going to do anything with the grass i think we're just going to plow over it but it is quite hard to see where the field starts and stops so let's go open up this gate over here and i think we'll just run the plow over it to outline the uh look at the field so that we know where it is and where to plant where not to plant um, later on in the episode we're also going to be reseeding that that field number seven as well we'll be planting some more crops mm, i like this uh field here it has a lot of openings to field number five you can see the two in front of us here and i'm pretty sure we can drive right through these bushes although i don't want to attempt it just yet there are it is a possibility we can link these two together i don't know if we can plow over those shrubs or not we'll find that out in a uh, later episode maybe we can have like a little super field in the front of oakfield farms here i'm not really sure so this is uh, quite the field so the first thing we're going to do is remove this tree it's uh, just going to be a lot easier to remove it then plow around it, seed around it, harvest around it. That's just ridiculous. Why is there one random tree growing in the middle of this field? It just makes no sense. So we're going to take it out. We're going to go into forestry machines. We're going to get the Lizard Trex 400, I think it is. The Lizard Trex 600, sorry. And we not going to play with the settings. It's already suited for forestry. Uh, tree removal doesn't really matter. No, we don't want to purchase. We just want to lease. I'd rather spend 10 grand rather than 190,000 on a machine I'm only going to use once or twice. 
All right, and we'll just go up here to the shop and easy peasy. We will just reset it back to the farm. And here we are. So now we'll just drive it over here. We will remove uh, that tree in the middle of the field. And I'm also going to remove some trees along the roadway uh, leading up to our farm as well. It just makes it easier to see. And uh, the trees are somewhat irrelevant to our operation here. So we don't really need them, although they look nice. They just get in my way. Uh, visually, they get in my way. So we're going to take them out. All right. So then uh, after we remove the trees, we're going to plow. And then we're going to reseed. So we're not going to make you sit through all that in real time because it will take just under two hours to complete those tasks. Um, so we're going to flip on the time lapse switch one more time on Oakfield Farms. Sit back, relax. Enjoy the time-lapse music. Let me know what you think. Leave a comment down below, and we will check back with you closer to the end of the video. Thanks for tuning in, folks.
All right, well, that is going to wrap up this episode, folks. Thanks for tuning in to JCTV. We're playing Farming Simulator 19 on the Xbox One console. This was Stranded in Oakfield, episode number 8. Don't forget, if you haven't done so already, click that subscribe button in the bottom right-hand corner of your screen. Ring that notification bell for me and like that, like and share this video. That would be greatly appreciated. Until next time, folks, this is JCTV saying see you later.